State line farmers are paying very close attention to those rainfall totals. It comes as we celebrate National Farmers Day across the nation. It's a chance to pay tribute to those who work to put food on our tables. Drea Baroni stopped by a local farm. Drea, what did you learn? Yeah, Eric, I had the chance to chat with a local farmer about the important role he plays in the community. Uh, even though 1% of our population is farmers, 100% um, of our population eats. Dairy and grain farmer Brent Pollard has helped feed the community since 2005. He, his wife, and kids work to maintain one of the many family-owned farms here in the state line. A lot of the farm organizations in the state of Illinois have this uh, We Are the 96 campaign uh, to spotlight that 96% of the farms in Illinois are family-owned. And it's not, we're not all big, big corporations that own us, you know, it's, it's farmers that have been family members and members of the community, you know, for in my case, you know, six generations here in Winnebago County. Throughout the years, Pollard has strived to harvest food that is suitable not only for the community, but also for his family. You know, everything that I produce on this farm, my family eats too. So I don't want anything bad to happen to the food that we produce here because we eat it too. So we're, you know, the first stewards in the environment, the first people that recycle. It's really, really important to us as farmers that we are good stewards of the land. Despite a drought this year, Pollard believes many farmers were able to harvest their crops. It was a tough year, but our crops did surprisingly well for how dry it is. It's amazing what all the people behind uh, growing seed have bred or created crops that are really, really stress tolerant, and it's um, helped us out quite a bit. It, it's been very surprising for everybody, every farmer that's been out in the combine on how good things have been this year for how little rain we got. National Farmers Day aims to offer praise to the many hard workers across the nation in the midst of harvest season. Eric. Thanks, Drea.